Hi, this is Russ from Escape Design Studios. I um, wanted to uh, pop in with a short video, uh, just a few seconds to uh, show you our latest project. Um, we uh, had a client who requested a thug slash bodybuilder character um, for a silicone mask that he wanted to have made um, for Halloween. And uh, we do ask that all of our uh, clients um, kind of give us some ample amount of time uh, to, to be able to sculpt uh, these projects, especially when uh, they're, um, they're custom, um, and he was kind enough to do so. Um, so he's given us several months to be able to, uh, to sculpt out the character, and um, which is only a part of the intensive process of making a mask. Um, once uh, we get this sculpture finished, this is just a uh, crude, uh, right now rough uh, sculpture. Um, but uh, we'll go in and do the fine details around, you know, in the skin and uh, and uh, veins and, and underneath the skin, and then we'll be ready to cast. Um, oh, excuse me, to mold. Um, and at that point, uh, we have to choose a material, and he uh, has chosen uh, silicone, which is a superior material for mask making. Um, latex, um, as you can see with this prop, um, is really rigid, and it's hard. And when you paint it, it looks great for props, but unfortunately, when you're trying to wear a mask, it just ends up, you know, eventually peeling and, and looking kind of uh, um, rough and uh, it doesn't take very many years for that to, to occur. Um, the silicone, this is the same character from the Light of Day uh, film that we're working on. Um, this, this is just a scrap piece of silicone uh, that we use to cast that character. And as you can see, it, it's really flexible. Um, it stretches and depending upon the type of silicone you use, you can get up to a 400 times stretch in there. It's very durable and it's more lifelike um, in its appearance. Um, so what we'll have to do is once we finish our sculpture, we will start the mold process and then cast in silicone and then go in and start doing the hair punching and the color uh, you know, uh, matching and things like that. So uh, there is a lot of work still left to be done um, just because there's a sculpture there doesn't mean we're even close. So, um, anyway, um, if you have a project that you're um, w that you would like to have done, uh, feel free to give us a call. Um, you can contact us uh, on our website. Uh, it's uh, escape-design.com, or uh, give us a call at uh, 801-452-5536. Thank you very much.